In this video, I'm going to take you through setting up a project that's stored on an SQL database. So I'm going to start with an empty project wizard. I'm going to set it as a local project. I'm going to give it a useful name. But now I'm going to change this to database instead of using local file. So I've clicked it. I need to give my application a name. Now I'm using Windows Authentication because I only intend for this to be used on this machine. Now if I was going to use multiple machines and use a central server, I'd use SQL Authentication, set up a discrete account on the SQL server, click this, pop in the username and password. We can also note the address in this instance, I'm using local slash SQL Express. Now this piece of information here, the DB connection string, this is really important. We're going to need this later on. So I'm just going to highlight it. I'm going to use the keyboard shortcut Control C. I'm just going to store it in my notepad, just there. So I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to come down and hit my arrow and finish. Now what it's doing is it's creating all of the tables relating to all the options we've got in Movicon Next. We'll be able to see that in a moment once it's completed in Management Tools. So it's now created our application in Management Studio. If I refresh this now, I actually have Demo SQL. And it's actually created all of the tables inside here. In our next video, I'm going to show you how you can start a SQL based project into runtime mode. Thanks for watching.